So I made a GIF with all these photos because they kind of look similar in the perspective. But what is all this? Is it, well, some old-timey things in a photo that I just took off on some random people while I was in the USA? Think about that, I haven't been there for a while. Well, no. This, today, we're going to be talking about a subject that's kind of very, very, very hard. Courtesy to this footage from Vox. Um, I, they, I didn't ask them for it, so I'll just say that it's from their channel. This is one of their Darkroom episodes. Which was the inspiration for Dark Sean. So, how will we get this party started? Da 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 Dark Sean presents da 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 Dark room Which presents to you Child Labor So let's get this started with, shall we? Well, let's get this started. Child labor. It's one of the most criminal things that has ever happened to human beings. I mean, some of, even I asked myself, was this even a thing? How could anyone even do this? So, let's just get this thing started off, will we? And I think we'll need the notes for this, so let's get this started. Okay, quick, 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 quick. Child labor what is this well it has something to do with children right and why am i even talking about it ever since i watched the dark room episode that ended with the season finale of dark room by vox i was like hey let's do it also partly inspired by the speech i was going to do and yeah so anyways more to be talked about here there's not much really left to talk about so let me quickly draw something here so, child labor is the thing where adults give children work under just one condition. You get low pay. And so, what happens? Ta -da! Great. Now get to work. What? This took one hour. Good job. Here's another 0 0.01 dollars. Seriously? <laughs> Alright, I'm taking away. Okay, okay. And so that's basically child labor in a nutshell. You basically have to do a lot of work with low pay. And for a while... The nation didn't know about it, until a guy came up and took all these photos. And they all have one thing in common. They met a guy named Louis Wicks Hun. So yeah, and all I can say is that he's an awesome guy, you dude. He's this guy right over here, but then again, there's not really much I can say about them. I mean, like, he, you have to go to school or else guy. I mean, all of these, all of these people have been to haven't probably never been to school they either have a part-time job or a full-time job and so because of his increasingly good photographing and because of that the nation started to say no to child labor and started sending them back to school good job ant man so yeah child labor is a bad thing and so what are we gonna do about it there's not really anything we can do is it? I mean, this guy even took pictures of people working on the Empire State Building. So what are we going to say? So they kept saying no to child labor. And more weird stuff happened. People weren't allowed to get a job, whether full-time or part-time, until they were 14 years old. And they weren't allowed to work in the mills unless they were 16. And the rest, you had to be like 18 years old. And the rest of the things where you need qualifications, you needed a degree. 
and all those useless, no degree needed jobs, well, all you needed to do was just do the work. You either use full time or part time. You weren't allowed to work before 7 o'clock, and you weren't allowed to work until after 19 o'clock, basically 17 p.m., and your time range was 7 a.m. all the way to 7 p.m. And so that's how all these labor laws started happening. And yay, boom, all these type of labor laws started happening up. So what was happening in the meantime? Say no to child labor? There's not really much to really say so. And are we ever going to say no to that? Yes, we already did. So let's just keep on doing it. And let's stop making the Empire State Building for heaven's sake. And now let's say no to child labor because there are injuries. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Dark Sean. Um, this is officially the end of season one. Season two, I will have to be doing like in in a while now. So if you guys have any suggestions for a season two, then please tell them in the comments below. Season actually, this isn't the end of season one. Season one will end when we get to the hundredth episode of the speeches. So I'll see you guys then. Shine out. Peace. Incoming instructions if you want to see what has been happening for the past few days. So, so happy new year everyone. See you soon.